everyone, welcome back to the channel. It is Fatone here, and today we are going to be completing a Hard Nights play, of course, which is the mini event, which I think ends on the 27th of September, if I'm right in saying so. And uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to a bigger event. I never really liked the mini events, but yeah, you know, we can't really complain. It's a few more items in the game that weren't in the game originally, so. Yeah, it's new things in it, new things. Um, also, make sure to subscribe as well to the channel. Um, if you'd like to join our community, our awesome community, should I say, in um, in our Discord server, then be sure to go to the link in the description and come and join us. So yeah, let's get started with the purpose of this video. So thank you all for coming in on such short notice. I'm just glad this isn't about Bart, or is it? <laughs> yeah, because if, if it is, we're not paying for another lawyer. He's going to have to represent himself. <laughs> this isn't about Bart, and if it was, I wouldn't have summoned every parent at the school. Hey, when this kid jumps, I'm required to ask how high and what's the damage. That was pretty good, Homer. Thanks. Words are just flown through me today. Maybe this intermittent fasting stuff's... Finally paying dividends. Eating between 8am and midnight isn't intermi intermittent fasting. <laughs> Homer, do you actually think that's what intermittent fasting is? I can eat my way through half a fridge and two fully stocked pantries in the middle of the night. So yeah, this fasting stuff has been a major sacrifice. Can we please speed this meeting up? I'm not allowed to meet, uh, allowed to keep meat or fish in my trunk. For more than an hour when I'm delivering groceries. Stage Manager Marge. My prompt book has all the cues for every production, even waiting for good art. So, here's the deal. Parents, we have one week to transform Mark Twain's Tom Sawyer into the best musical Springfield Elementary has ever staged. Mark Twain didn't write Tom Sawyer, it's a rush song. Homer's right. A modern day warrior, mean, mean stride, today's Tom Sawyer, mean, mean pride. Bands back then had so much drum. They did indeed, Homer, they did indeed. Look, you guys are all here today because we need your help to make this the best play our school has ever staged. So now you're subcontracting your own job to us parents, what gives you the right? Yeah, does that mean we'll get us cut to the school budget? Or a chunk of your sweet teacher salary? No, and it's not subcontracting, it's parental participation. As for the budget, I can offer you all the leftover school pizza your heart's desire. I'm in, eat pizza. Okay, so here's a stack of Tom Sawyer, the musical script, for you all to read. Why does it have to be Tom Sawyer? Shouldn't we, oh, I don't know, pick something less political? Political Tom Sawyer is a cultural landmark. Its realistic depiction of ordinary American life remains a candid reflection of the complexities within our society, then and now. It was a suggestion. So are you parents in for some parent, parent participation? I'm in. Fine, I'm in. I'm in. Mmm, participation pizza. And there we go. So we've got, <clears throat> obviously, the first outfit. So yes, let's get the next part. So, do I have any volunteers for set design? I'd love to do set design. Wow, that was fast. Thanks, Marge. Absolutely. And would you mind if I also handed all of the stage management and costuming too? I don't want to come off too strong, but back in high school, I was a pretty big deal as the theatre class stage manager. I doubt anyone here would mind. Ugh, we'll just store that. Bart, Lisa, come downstairs. I've got news from school. If a wasp hive exploded in Skinner's office and slash or car, I had no knowledge of it. No, it's not that. It's good news. Did the school finally accept my advanced curriculum proposal? Nope. Something way better than that. Well, now you're just hyping this up too much. It'll probably be a total letdown. The school's putting on a play and guess who's directing? Awesome. Now I'm betting one of us ends up as the lead because that's our usual look. Well, Bart, since you mentioned it. <laughs> so yeah, we'll be back. 
with part three. I don't know. I don't know if I have a line that fence, you know. Now, I get it, but where would you use it? I don't, I, I don't, I don't know. But yeah, we'll be back with part three. The play we'll be putting on is a musical adaptation, uh, adaptation of Tom Sawyer. Wait, is that already a thing that exists? Or do we have to write a bunch of songs about Tom Sawyer and Huckleberry Finn? Shh, Lisa, if we don't ask those questions, we don't have to worry about answering them. I mean, that is a kind of question, uh, kind of an important question that needs answering. Well, and this isn't ne nepotism or anything, but I think Bart... Fine, fine, I'll play Tom Sawyer. I mean, it's sort of a role I was born to play. <laughs> I wish that wasn't the case, but it really is. Sweet, we got the building. I can just get stored. Uh, so, uh, play, sorry. Then I said sword. Uh, so, we are to be Thespian's delightful. If this play doesn't involve me pounding him, I'd rather go back to math. I'm going to be a tree. Thank you, children. Please sit down so we can talk about our play. We will be performing a musical adaptation of Mark Twain's classical American story, Tom Sawyer. I'll play Tom Sawyer if Lisa's Becky. Punches Millhouse. Stop being a creep, Millhouse. Wait, a musical? Oh no, that's going to mean singing. And the costumes from that time period will not even be slightly cute. Here to help me explain our plans, let me welcome Marge Simpson, who will be helping out with our set design and costuming. Hello, children. So, Marge, would you like to let everyone know who will be playing Tom Sawyer? My special guy, Bart Simpson. Ha <laughs> ha. And the role of Huckleberry Finn, Nelson Montz. Ha <laughs> ha. Ah, so that is part four done. Next, we get that decoration bundle, which I do like. I'll probably... Oh, right. When, when we do our um, Springfield Elementary design competition, guys... I would like this bundle, decoration bundle, in it. I'll probably announce that as well, but I would like that with it. So yeah, I'll be... Bart's casting is clearly nepotism at work. Yeah, I don't think Bart's even read Tom Sawyer. I mean, neither have I. I doubt that Bart could properly convey the complexities of Tom Sawyer's loss of innocence in the immoral, harsh world he's forced to navigate. I get to play a tree. Well, Marge, as stage manager, you get the fun and rewarding task of calming the kids down and preparing them for a curtain call. I'm going to get a much-deserved massage. All right. Here and so build the set. No one, because no volunteers means all of you. Nicely done. I'm stealing that. We'll, we'll just place these just there for now. See so yeah, how we complete gold for. Peace and quiet. I'd forgotten what it felt like. Aye, lassie. Tis a right good day, it is. Burst in. They've got him doing it all wrong. If this is about that play, I don't want to hear about it. That's a problem for the parents to deal with. No, it's not the play. It's that boy they have playing Tom Sawyer. He's doing the whitewashing and he's doing it all wrong. Boy Simpson, I should have known he'd mock up a simple task like that. When did we all start caring so much about painting? It doesn't matter. We spent this entire summer painting this godforsaken school. I know. We're practically experts. Let's bombard him with some information. We're teachers, aren't we? Fine. If it'll make you all shut up, let's go teach Tom Sawyer the proper method of applying a consistent top coat. So yes, we'll be back with part five and the final part of this mini event. Yeah, and we get a building at least to end it off with. Down then up, it's not rocket science. Sure, but you guys understand that this is a prop fence. It's made of cardboard. Respect the art of painting or no bombardment all year. No bombardment sounds like a good deal. Throws dodgeball. Bombardment! Ow. So yes, we've got... Oh, that's a nice day, you know. I thought it was only smaller than that, but I like that. Whitewash Judy, such a joy. Best believe I ain't got no ploy. Tom Sawyer, you sly fox, giving us your chores while you skip rocks. Paint it up, paint it down. Tom so Tom's turned his work into our playground. Yes, time has turned this white fence brown, but by day's end, we'll paint the town. I'm a tree, yes, I'm a tree. I'm a tree, I'm a tree. Take a break and lean against me. 
Did our boy just remember his lines and sing them properly? Or did you accidentally give me the good scotch on the way over here? Our boy's a star. Sayona Missouri takes a bow, curtain falls. And that's it, we did it, everyone. Wait, what's going on? Is that real applause? That was the best play your school has ever put on, and your teachers seem to have finally received the rest they deserve. Good work, Seymour. Why, thank you, sir. You did so good, Bart. Mum, everyone's still around, waiting until we're home. Nope, I'm just so proud of my special little guy, picks up Bart and hugs him. And there we go, guys. We have completed the Hard Plays Night. Now, let's roll on to the Treehouse of Aura event, which we all know is going to be coming in October. So, yes. If you don't want to miss that, make sure to hit that like, comment, and subscribe button. Be sure to join the Fat Tony's Mafia Discord server. And have a great day, and I'll see you all in the next one. Peace.